Day. It's uh, November the 9th. Um, it's about 1.30 in the afternoon. It's pouring, been pouring the rain all morning. Um, snuck in over here and set a blind in a spot we always hunt. Uh, I don't like to climb when it's raining. I'm just scared of slick trees. So I went and got a blind, brung it in and brushed it in at 1 o'clock. <clears throat> so I'm going to see what happens. Um, I got it tucked in pretty good and uh, we got a bunch of scrapes coming down this flat and they've been chasing in here so uh, there's a nice eight pointer in here and another nice uh, I think he's a nine uh, we're gonna try to kill uh, gun season opens back home tomorrow we'd like to get killed out get back home and try to get back in the woods with a bow before before they kill our bucks with a gun so uh, it's Jackie sex with Dine Reaper I'm hot just got everything set up I'm gonna get in here and see what happens stick with me Well, baby. Come tonight. All right, so you can see my blind behind me. I come in today and took that in to hunt this flat right here. It's been pouring rain, as you can tell. I wetter than a dog. But uh, I think I seen this buck lay down. Um, I'm gonna try to try to find him in the daylight so we can get it on video. Um, it looked like a hard shot. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure I smoked him, but. Uh, the auto lock, I mean, it just, it blew through him. Um, I walked up there, couldn't find my arrow. I don't know where, it's probably buried up in that wood somewhere. Because I seen it go through him, but I can't find it. Um, <coughs> so I'm going to ease up here and see if we can find some blood. Uh, I seen a little bit of blood right there where I shot him, but I don't know exactly which way he went up. But we're going to go up here and see if we can't get on him. All right, there's my blind. And he was standing right, right here when I shot him. Uh, him and that doe come over this hill right here. So I got blood right here. I'm gonna ease up there. Here. See if I can't find him. See, it's been about an hour. It's been raining, so this blood is real, real wet, real watery. But there is. There's some pretty decent blood here. It's probably too dark to see it. There it is. You can see. It's that blood right there. Get it right up through here.
There's a white belly right there. He didn't go. He didn't go 80 yards. Ain't done no high. He's done. He's toast. Look at the blood. There he lays. Go for get our hands on him. There he is. Alright, he's pretty good one. Hard shot. That auto lock tore him wide open in it. Yeah. There he is. Alright. Go on here. That is for sure. Let me get this thing set up. Big old high eight pointer. Uh, tall tines, tight rack. Come in, come in just a little bit ago chasing a doe. And uh, he made the wrong move. I made the right one for once. So it's been a long year and uh, glad to be done in Ohio. Now I can go home and get folks back in on my, my hit listers back home. Uh, this buck, I actually hunted this buck last year in here and he come in on me and uh, he broke his left side off completely. So uh, I guess it's just meant to be. He got bigger this year, uh, a little longer tines, and uh, nice deer. Been watching him for a few years over here. But uh, man, the auto lock, I mean, it put him down. I mean, I can still see my blind. I thought I'd seen him lay down here, but I wasn't sure. But uh, can't say enough about auto lock. You know, that's, that's two bucks this week that, that me and one of my good buddies killed with the auto lock. And, both of them's been unreal blood. I mean, usually when you shoot them, they don't. You don't need blood trail because they're laying, you know, pretty close. But uh, I mean, we're lucky to be with those guys, Mark and Roger, and big thanks to them and Ozonics. I mean, couldn't done it without the Ozonics. I mean, the wind was swirling in here like crazy. Uh, I'd come in and popped a ground blind up today in the rain, and uh, you know it just worked out for me. But uh, got it done. The Black Eagle zipped through him. Where it went, I don't know, but uh, it's probably still going. But uh, I'll look for it again, a little better light maybe, and see if I can find it. But uh, I'd actually grabbed the wrong arrow tonight. Uh, I wasn't paying attention. And uh, I grabbed the arrow without my nocturnal on it. Uh, I'd lost one nocturnal, and uh, I, I, forgot, I forgot that I had arrow in there without it. I didn't pay any attention to it when I shot it. But, uh, you know, when it's good bright and daylight like this, you know, we can, we can see pretty good, but that nocturnal makes it that much better. But uh, I knew that uh, I knew that he wasn't going to go far with that shot. But uh, like to uh, like to thank Steve Moore for having me. And, and uh, this is uh, this is Jackie Sexton with Tyne Reaper. And we got uh, this is the third buck for us this year. We've got. Uh, me and Charles Dillard's got two more. We got both got a Kentucky tag still, and he's got an Ohio tag, and he's still out tonight. So, wish him luck. He may be sticking one any minute. So, well, thanks for watching, Tyne Reaper. Stick with us.